it's the owner of this Tech Talks account's daughter. And if you look behind me, then you can see my science project. I bought a bunch of different bottled waters, and I just tested the pH level of all of these. And I'm here today to expose some of your favorite waters that you probably buy and are terrible for you, and you didn't even know. Or maybe they're really good for you and you stopped buying them because you thought that they were terrible, but they're actually really good. I'm going to have to make this pretty quick. Here's core. Oh, yeah, and here's the little scale. There's core. Life water. Alkaline. 88. This, that thing. Jove or love. I don't know which one it says. 10. Yeah, pretty high. Whatever that says. Smart water. Flow. Fuji. Karma. This is plain karma with no flavoring because the flavoring gives colors. Yeah. Yeah. That's right about there. Don't buy this brand. From, straight from the Florida Springs, I think yes. And that is your favorite waters. Oh, that's terrible lined up. But basically the ones that you do want to buy are 10. Oh yeah, and I almost forgot. We also tested our filtered tap water. We have filtered tap water, and <laughs> all the water in our house is filtered, and look at where that got us. Some pretty good water. So here we have all the waters. So the waters that you do want to get, 10, great. Smart water, pretty good, dang good. Whatever that says, the one from the Florida Springs. That's also very good. Oh, another one that you want to get. This Alkaline 88 one. Get that. Jove. It's pretty good. I would get that if I were you. 10. I would get that. Get a filter because look at that. That's from our tap. Smart water. Pretty good. I would get that. Flow. Eh. Could go. You could do better. Fuji. Could do way better. Karma. Don't get that. Don't, don't. This one, get it, of course. Life water, don't, 